What is going on guys? Awesome Nerd Show here and today we're doing another special video where we're building a Lego set. Here we have the Lego Creator Winter Village Fire Station set 10263 from this set. So it um, goes apart with the Winter Village which I do have about five I think sets of it so far. And this is the new one that just came out this year. I got this for my birthday and I've been holding off on it to build it out of course. Um, this will be going up at the beginning of December and stuff and so I wanted to wait you know to get ready. You know, It was kind of like a countdown to Christmas thing. Um, to go ahead and build this and stuff. So we, uh, I've done one video like this before, and I do have more planning on coming because I assume, like for Christmas and stuff, I'll get more Lego sets and everything. Um, but I'm planning on doing like videos on whenever I do get new Lego sets from now on. Um, but again, this is the Lego Creators, and it's the Winter Village Fire Station. So we got a fire station here in the background, as you can see. We have a fire truck over here, which I guess you, yeah, you can see there, fire truck. And we have two like um, firemen. Then we have you know, a lady with a baby, a snowman, a little pond frozen pond here for um, ice skating it looks like they're playing hockey we got a little band over here some guy with the saxophone and stuff so all sorts of fun little things to go on and build here so there's a little bit uh, more of a view you can see all the different stuff that's going on so we will see the inside of the fire station and then all sorts of little activities and stuff going on over here but of course I'm going to build it and then at the very end we'll go through and look at each you know little piece and figure and everything and stuff um, so I'm super excited to finally build this like I said I've been holding on to this for a while now um, so let's go ahead and get to building. I will be a time lapse and stuff. Um, you'll see me building everything. So I hope you enjoy that. So let's get into it. And it is now complete and this set was pretty fun and cool to build and everything. It's a nice big set with a lots of different characters and a nice like festive scenery. So we'll start with the outside stuff first. Um, again, it's hard to fit everything into the uh, site here, whatever I guess we'll start. So first up we have this lady. I assume it's just supposed to be like a mom or some could be like a sister because she's got the short legs. So but she is, you know, um, so she is pretty short, but um, she is pushing this uh, sled here with the little... Uh, baby what I call sewer baby of course from the Lego movie 2 commercial and stuff the little baby and I love it because it's got the little tiny head and everything which it was separate and I didn't know they made like things that small like the little baby characters and stuff so that's so much fun so that's a nice little sled that we got there which we'll sit aside now um, then here you can see up front here we do have um, a little Dalmatian dog so just a little tiny uh, Lego dog here to go with the firehouse so and everything so they made a dalmatian of course to fit along with it we'll set that aside we have all sorts of little um fire station workers we'll sit her back over there which this one i don't think we can fit unless i move it 
this, I can move this back some and try and fit it in. Here we have our little hockey arena. So it's just a little like frozen um, lake. It looks like, you know, a fountain here, a firefighter with a water hose. You know, it's supposed to normally be shooting water out, but it's got frozen. So it's just a piece of ice and now it's a frozen lake. And you have a little guy here, a little kid uh, playing hockey. So he's got a hockey stick. He's got um, little skates on his feet, which are new things that I've never seen before. They're just two little like blade things you push into the bottom of their feet. And so he can be, you know, hockey skating. We have just a little pe Lego piece here. Um, a Lego stud that, you know, is like to play hockey with and everything. So that's a fun uh, little piece there to have um, to go into the village set. Um, then over here we just have a little like bench and lighting. I do like this new lamp. So I have a couple of these and like every single lamp is different, but I really like this one a lot. So this one has um, a like formed base or whatever. I forget, like a molded base. So it's its own Lego piece from the base all the way up to the top here and I really like that it's got you know this detail and uh, design going into it. it looks like an actual like street lamp and everything and then of course you add the pieces on to make the lamps and I like that and it's got little red dots probably for like holly or something just some sort of decoration then we got a bench and we have two more I believe to be fire station workers just because they're outfit at least this guy for sure and then we got a guy here in like a suit and he's got a saxophone and he's got little like decorations there on his shoulders and a hat stuff so he's a musician of some sort so that's fun. I like that character with the saxophone and everything. Um, we have a little, like, uh, scooter type thing. So you can obviously put characters on. And it's a little scooter. It easily moves back and forth. It moves super slick and easy. So that's really nice. Um, then we've got our fire truck, which, of course, we'll see here in the fire station. So here's a look. It's got number four on it. It's got a bunch of little dials of stickers that I put on stuff. I assume these here are supposed to be the fire hoses since it, this matches um, the statue version. Um, so we got, like, the fire hoses there on the side, some gauges, as I said, tools there on the back. And then we have um, LJ. I don't know what that's supposed to be or what it's supposed to stand for, but then it's the set number of 10263 or 10263 which is the set number everything then we have ladder four so that's the truck number it has four and everything on it so it's a nice uh truck decoration of course has a wheel a seat it has this little tool toolbox that's like a new like molded thing at least that i've not seen it which um doesn't open or anything though but i still really like and enjoy that and then we have the ladder of course which can twist around and it moves and it does extend out some oops i just pulled it all the way out but it has some like locking mechanism here on this that doesn't you know kind of holds it and controls it but I like this ladder and how you can twist it around to fit and everything it fits nice with the fire station we'll sit that there uh, then we've got another fire station person just looks probably to be like the chief or something since he's an older guy as you can see there we'll just stick him on the front there and then we have this in the little tree which again like the lamppost each set has like its own tree and they make it a little bit different this has been like the new form they're going with and I really do enjoy it so it's just like you know a triangle type shape piece I forget what they're called and then you just add more of those shapes on top to get it um, fatter and then you just they just um, each go on different directions so it makes like the tree shape and then of course I have all the little studs of the ornaments of the red and uh, yellow colors there and we have a little train there so like a toy train supposedly in that present they're sitting underneath the bottom of it so that is all the accessory pieces now we can look at the actual fire station itself so I'll pull it closer here. So as you can see, just on the outside, we do have a little snowman over in this corner. A little, I like the top hat on it. Um, I really enjoy that. It has, of course, some decorations on the outside. So it has like this red box with a light. I don't know what's supposed to be, but it's just, you know, assume some sort of like emergency light or something. Like if there's a call or something, it'll light up. Um, we have these nice lanterns on the outside. They use what look like paint rollers to be held onto the building. And I like that. We have some, of course, uh, um holly and uh, i forget what's mistletoe like or decorations hanging on the firehouse to make it look more christmasy and stuff and then of course i like all the like snow it's supposed to be snow on so we got like icicles and stuff dripping down off the building you can see them on the front there and everything we do have a little door over to the side here that you can go out of um let's see what else we can look of course the doors which we'll look at in a second over on this side we have a fire hydrant and then stairs that go up to the top level up here which is nice because that's the only really the only way you can get up to the top level in these is through this door um there's no like inside stairs or anything and of course the same on this side as well then we'll move forward we have of course the upper level windows and stuff just nice decorations i like the deck decorations of like this that's much more detail into it and everything and i like this tower over here just to look you use like uh railings or something to build this and it made it look really nice and it was just two pieces that 
attached together and it looks really nice I really enjoy that of course we do have which it'll be hard to see probably it does have the light up function so there you can you just press on this top I don't know if I can even really get you to see it yeah it's got the light up you just push on that and it lights up so it makes like the bell what's supposed to be right here light up and then it goes down into the firehouse so it'd be nice to like have it pushed down and lit up it um, makes everything look really nice but then we can go down here where we can go into the fire station itself so we'll just go ahead and drive through the doors into the fire station and then we will turn around to see the inside where we can have like the engine pulling through okay so this is the inside now so we have our lower level here which of course is where the engine sits and everything so we have a basket full of tools some extra helmets and stuff all the characters come with a helmet to put on their head two fire extinguishers in the time so you can see you know time which looks like it's all crooked here we go looks like it's almost three o'clock by the time on there um, then on this side we have a le uh, le uh, pole that goes all the way down so characters can come over here get on the pole and slide all the way down to the bottom which of course then leads to the outside door that I mentioned earlier then to the engines of course and that's really yeah there's nothing really on the sides of either in there then we have our upper level the whole like uh, rec area or just place the hangout and stuff so we have a table here with a coffee cup and a hot dog and chairs that swivel and stuff we have a what I assume to be a bunk bed here but it does fold up and it has a calendar and a picture of the Dalmatian and of course a bone and so I assume the Dalmatian's bed is down under here again we have uh, more something I don't know what this is supposed to be it's just supposed to be like some uh, thing it's got the little lever up here that you can move back and forth about and what it's supposed to be um then we got a little kitchen back here so there's like a stove um a sink a counter dishwasher or i think i already said is what i meant to say and it has a little pan on the oven which again it's hard to see in there there you can see a little better and the coffee cup is in what looks to be a coffee maker the way it's designed i really like the way they did that and then of course our emergency red phone there and then of course the door that come in and that's pretty much it for this set. There's nothing really more to look at. Nothing um, there we can see what it looks like when it's lit up on the inside. There you can see the light and everything. So I, again, I really like that. I wish it was just a way to like keep it pushed down though for if you want to have it on and everything. So this again is a really nice piece to add on to the rest of the village. Um, like I said, I know they've been building, doing a lot of village pieces over the years, and I have like five of them now, but I don't have, you know, every single one they've ever made. Um, but I really do enjoy this one. I feel this will make the town go together really nice and stuff, which unfortunately I don't have room to set up, um, so I can't really do all that together. But with all this stuff, it's a really nice um, village addition and everything. Of course, it did cost uh, quite, what, I fe what to me feels like um, more than I feel it should for this but maybe for the count piece and stuff it's not too bad and you do get a lot of characters um like minifigs which are usually you know price wise and stuff where things come in but i think it's a nice big set it's definitely like the tallest building we've had yet so that's really nice too and then uh just one show did have two books so we had the book one and book two um it did use two books to build it and everything so that's going to be it for this um pretty i guess building and review of the lego creator set of the fire winter village fire station set one zero 263 so i hope you all enjoyed this and are gonna have a happy holidays and merry christmas if that's what you celebrate all that stuff because like i said this is going up in early december just to kick off the holidays on here on the channel and stuff but thank you all so much for watching leave don't forget to subscribe to see more videos hopefully i'll have more legos coming up if i get more for christmas and everything and of course we have all the lego games on the channel and stuff like that so i hope you all enjoy if you did let me know in the comments down below and don't forget to leave a thumbs up and like i said subscribe to the channel to see more and we'll see you next time